Yo, what's the hold up? Your mom already hates me. I've been here for like five minutes, not even like two minutes. Ooh, oh, God, the sun is so bright. Okay. Yeah, wow, Jesus Christ, you live in a fucking paradise. I mean, there's a little bit of scrap metal everywhere, but... The water is all clean and shit. You got flowers everywhere, big-ass pumpkins. You are living in the lap of goddamn luxury. It is gorgeous over here. Must be nice being tucked in a corner away from all the bullshit the town has. Yo, Aerith, what's the hold up in there? Where are you in this room? Aerith! God damn it. Burning daylight! Mama. Mama Elmire, I don't know what to do. You take this one. Okay. Take it. Right. Off we go. <laughs> and these right here are my babies. Beautiful. <gasps> Is that a sea turtle? No, it's a fetch. I thought it was a sea turtle down there. I got excited. Cloud, holy shit, why are you so stiff? Usually as smooth as a ribbon. You never held a bucket before? Jesus, do what she's doing. At the very least, carry it with your elbow. Or are you afraid that looked too girly for you? Which ones do you think we should pick? Uh, no. Oh, don't be like that. I know you have an eye for this kind of thing. Um... I could choose. Choose flowers to deliver to the leaf house. Press triangle, close to the garden, pick flowers. Well, can I pick the blue ones back here? The blue ones look pretty. No, of course not. All right. Oh, only these. Okay. Well, there's the flowers you gave me. There's, well, those don't look attractive. Those just look like bananas. Um, Cloud, can you, thank you. Um, I don't know. I guess the prettiest flower is this one. Is that, yeah, That's the this one, one I gave you. Yep. Huh. It is. Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. Uh, Cloud, <laughs> what kind of magic flower powers do you have? You put one in there and it just fucking sprouted a garden. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Uh, these. Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? Sure. I mean, these are just the prettiest looking ones. I don't like those banana looking flowers. She said, as many as you can carry. So maybe a few more? Um... I don't want the banana looking flowers, all those, those look ugly. I mean, I guess it has a sense of variety, but okay, fine. Uh, you have any more flowers over here? Any reds or blues or anything? You're killing me here, Aerith. There's all these pretty flowers and the prettiest flowers I can't pick. So I, I guess I'll just pick more of these. I'm not picking those banana flowers. Those banana flowers look ugly. I don't like them. Put the butterfly in the basket, Cloud. Some kid will love that. You could sell that for like a thousand bells. Now. What do you say? Shall we go? God damn it is so fucking gorgeous here. You got a nice view and everything. If I didn't see all the debris everywhere, I wouldn't even be convinced that we're in the same town right now. No need to hurry. We're not under the gun or anything. Not yet. I'm cut out for this crap. <laughs> sure you are. And when you're done, you'll be drowning in job offers. I mean... Will I? <laughs> I just turned into a flower boy and they're like, Hey, can you kill some monsters for me? <laughs> I guess. I mean, I guess that's kind of how it worked in uh, Section 7. I helped a girl find her cats and she was like, Yo, can you help me kill a dragon? So, how do you think they'll arrange these flowers? Oh. Don't know. Well, we'll soon find out. Put them around the school, I get, Or not the school, the orphanage, I guess. See, that's what I'm talking about. Get some of those. Get some variety. We just got yellows and whites, and then the bananas were more yellow. It was like a faded yellow. I want some reds. I want some blues. Gotta get some variety for these kids. This is why their life is miserable. Oh, well, I mean, besides the whole, you know, dead parents thing. Yo. I got you, you damn flowers. I don't want to hurry, because Aerith told me not to hurry, and the last time I backsassed her, she backsassed me three times as hard. I'm afraid of you, Aerith. Well, no, I don't want to say I'm afraid of you. That's not the right word. I don't want to deal with your shit. <laughs> so I'm just going to do what you tell me to do. Nerd. Sorry, that was mean. 
See, look, these kids are growing weed. <laughs> I want some of that. They don't need these flowers. I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? I don't wanna... I wanna climb up there. No, it's much too dangerous. But I have to climb up there so people will like me and think I'm cool. Ugh. How do kids come up with these silly games? That was... Oh boy. <laughs> that was that was super fucking stilted. I'm scared of the doggy. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I wanna pet it. Pet it. Don't even ask. Just go straight for the pet. Uh, hello. That's what's called easy money. We even got to be on TV. And to think, all we had to do was shit talk avalanche behind that reporter. Well, fuck you. <gasps> 9S! How did you find me? How did, how did you find me? Wait, <laughs> how did you find me? <laughs> I was really happy, and now I am quickly getting weirded out. Hi, pal. I understand you must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research. Not at all. I've been getting you a lot of stuff, man. So, so, uh, so, buddy, you know I love you, but, um, you know, how did you find wow. me? I've come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Of course, young man. I have the most amazing news. What's up? I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia. Something <gasps> heretofore thought impossible. That sounds so awesome. That this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. Okay. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat obtuse. Nah, man, it's 2020. I know what VR is. 9S has developed a new combat simulator, VR missions. As you gather more and more battle intel, special missions. <gasps> is that Ice Lady? I forget what her name is, but she's she's hot as shit. Uh, allowing you to battle summons will become available. I have to battle these fucking things. Please let me know when you have made your preparations. Ooh, buddy, I don't know about that. I guess I'm ready to fight Ice Witch. Blue, I'm I'm ready to fight the Blueberry Bitch as soon as I give you all this research. I've done it. Developed a new materia. Cool. All right, let's let's do Shiva. That's her name. Data compiled on the ice element has resulted in the successful reproduction of Shiva, the Lady of Frost. All right, I'll I'll fight Blueberry Bitch. Sure, why not? I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator. All right, let's do it. Hello, madam. Well, that does jack and shit to you. Hey, can I assess you while I'm in here? Allow me. All right, we're getting metagamey in here. Yeah, of course, fire is your weakness. Lesser resistance, that. A uh, nice element summon recreated in virtual reality is the manifestation of a queen who has once healed the plant's wounds with ice, as evidenced by the existence of permafrost in the polar lands. Oh, is that what they call it? Mmm, <laughs> you be gliding. All right. You look cool as shit. Ow, bitch. You look cool as shit. I will say that. Fuck you. Yep. Oh. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Cloud, I need you to fucking move right now. God damn it, Cloud, I hate you. Oh my god, you're fucking trail. You just run. Ow. I want to get my fire, but every time I get close, then I have to fucking heal myself. Oh hell no. Oh hell no. Oh hell no. Yeah, no, it is not. Um. Mm. Yes, fuck it. All good. No, ah, uh, shit. I just need to get my fire up, for fuck's sake. Don't do your skid shit. Do not do your ski shit. Bitch. Uh, uh. Even fire doesn't do shit to you! Oh, I'm not ready for this fucking fight. Okay, can't block that. And I'm totally dead. Yep. Just get it over with. What a shame. It was a close match. However, don't lie to me, Nina. To obtain valuable data, analyze and learn from your mistakes so that you can claim victory next time. Don't. 
Don't lie to me, Nine S. That was not a close fight at fucking all. All of your future battle intel submissions. All right, yeah, no, I, I am definitely not fucking ready for that fight at all. Um, yo, dude, I need that CD. I need that CD. I don't, I don't, I don't care about any of the material you sell. I just, just want this. I'm a collector, you see. I don't know what I'm gonna use these for, but. What's up, Oats? Where's Aaron? The Leaf House. Well, fuck you, kid! <laughs> Piece of shit! I like that. That's looking pretty good, actually. Yeah, fuck it. I'll buy one of those. 2,000, holy shit! I mean... Shit, Take I guess it's worth it. Take care of my money, you hear? That's $2,000 for a goddamn bracelet! This shit better help me defeat Shiva! You know what? I'm gonna kick that kid's ass. You know what? I will go back. I'm gonna kick that kid's ass. Yo. Oh, hi. Uh, I'm here for air- okay, I guess I don't talk to you. Um... Kids! Nah, fuck the kid, nah. Where's- where's Oats? Y'all fucking up the chalkboard and shit with your drawings? <laughs> That's Wedge's kid right there. Uh, don't mind me, I'm just gonna steal from you kids. Bottle of ether. You know what? I'm doing you kids a favor. You don't need to be fucking sniffing this. God knows it's gonna happen. Yo. Madam. House mother. Other mother. Whatever your name is. I need to- I need to talk to Aerith. I guess I don't- Do I just go through the- Where's the kid? Where's Oats? I need to kick his ass. I also need to speak with Aerith. Less importantly, I need to speak with Aerith. But more importantly, I need to kick Oats' ass. Yo! Oh, I'm gonna kick your ass! You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. That sounds like rude. That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. Mm. They say he's sick or something. Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. Oh. I don't like the sound of this. Yes. I'm check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. It's probably going to be a Come different on. numbered man. Yeah, why did you talk to me? I'm the kid with, or I'm the dude with a big ass sword. <laughs> Fuck you, kid. You know what? Oh, it's, I'm gonna kick your ass if I ever come back to this place. It's probably gonna be a different numbered monk, but yeah, we're we're probably gonna meet the council of monks or whoever the hell this is. Whatever the hell's going on with these spirits and ghosts. Yeah, Aerith, that's another question I have for you. What the hell's going on with all these spirits and these ghosts and these specters and shit? Also, throwing that on me and my friends, just throwing that out there. Shit ain't cool. I know this place is off limits to grown-ups, but if we want to rescue them, well, Grown what? we gotta break the rules. Excuse me? <laughs> um, I'm assuming this is Kitty Kingdom back here. Oh, shit. Yeah, alright. Wow. Hi. Let's come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there. Bitch, Don't you think worry. I give a fuck about a monster? I've brought a super strong friend along with me. Well, thank you. Used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared, and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. Well, thank you, Aerith. Thank you for the compliment. I, too, think you are a very strong Please, opponent. Flower. Against the monsters, flower. not for me, Won't obviously. Of course, me? I'm not gonna... Yo, that kid's going mental. Somebody needs to help that kid. Um, I ain't afraid of no monsters. If y'all are really afraid of monsters, you wouldn't be so close right to the monster hole. Way. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I ain't afraid of no monster, kid. I got this. But yes, thank you for the compliment, Eric. Who knows? They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. Got some intense ass battle music. Uh. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting oh. myself. Oh. <laughs> You're starting to sound like Tifa. Get your hands off me. I was worried about the fucking monsters down there. Oh shit. Get your hands off her. Now that she's actually kind of starting to be nice to me, I'm starting to tolerate this woman. Ah, uh, there they are. Hey, kids. And they're not alone. 
What the, okay, how did y'all get yourselves in that situation in the first place? Y'all jumped in the fucking river and got yourselves stranded? Hello, rats. I'll protect you. Come at me. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. I mean, you say that, but you're quickly being surrounded by rats right now. Don't get me wrong. You are quite powerful, but still. Fucking rats. God damn, they just love you. I got you. Oh, there's another. I still don't understand the naming behind these damn things. Why are they called were rats? That implies that they used to be human and they fucking turn into a rat. Oi! Get away from the kids. Let's do this. Yeah, also me. I'm here too. I mean, no one no one acknowledges us, Cloud, you know. Sometimes I feel like we're not even the protagonist. Oh god. Uh I don't have thunder on me. What about fire? Fire and smog should make an explosion, but well, maybe not an explosion, but at least some kind of effect. No, bitch, bitch. That's not fair. You knocked me in it. You're fine. Everything's fine. Just get cloud up. Everything is gonna be okay. I'm here. It's some bullshit ass bullshit. All right, he knocked me into it. You've got this. Fight through it. Uh, I don't want to get in there right away. Now I do. Uh, no, I don't need to move. Just kill it. There we go. And that thing explodes, so I'm just gonna get the fuck back. Oh, great, there's more. Uh, I need this. Aerith, how you doing? You can heal yourself, right? Uh, that's the MP. Yeah, no, that's right. You need two for that. Uh, how about for right now, you just... Pop one of these. Back to good now. Get ready. Fucking off me. Bitch. The fuck? What was all that lightning shit? Oh, fire. Okay, can't. Alright. Okay. I'm getting big bodied right now. Fuck you, Aerith. Uh. Hit you with this. Get your hands off me. Why don't you my potion was stolen. You bitch! Off me! Give me my fucking potion back! Whatever. Get ready. Fuck over here. Okay. Oh, good. There's more. Oh, man. I was hoping. No. Oh, good. There's two of them. Uh, you just need to go down first. I probably should save that for when you start doing your move. Don't... Everything's gonna be fine. Ah, bitch! I'll hear you heal you up too. You are getting fucking pressured right now. But so are you, bitch! Uh, I can't say never again. Okay. I don't want to hear a damn thing, Earth. I don't want to hear a goddamn thing. They boxed me in a corner. You saw that shit. Nope. Do. Just Go fucking on. fall over. Uh, Cloud, you need... Not that. You need one of these, big boy. There you go. How long can I charge this? I can charge it up down there, but does it go even further? Uh, I'll find that out one of these days. No, you're gonna be fine. I hate these things. I hate these fucking things. I would rather fight a thousand sweepers as opposed to one of you. God damn it. I can get that off me, but it's not gonna matter. Um, how almost dead are you? You're... You're getting there. Uh, fuck it. No. Hey, I need you to get the fuck away from her. On the fucking ground. Oh boy. Hi, kids. Give me your hand. Watch out. The ground's really shaky. It's because of the reactor. You can't trust your feet. I'll go. <laughs> hey, kids, hop on my back. I'm a superhero. 
<laughs> Simple as saving a cat from a tree. Thank you. No problem. That was cool. <laughs> okay, let's head back. Oh yeah, don't don't mind me, kids. I'm sorry if I got a little bit of blood on you. It's just you know that that battle really hurt us. Here you go, Earth. Oh, we're gonna have to escort these fucking kids through monsters, aren't we? Oh no. Oh no, my video game instincts are kicking in. No, it's gonna send more after us, isn't it? Cloud, Cloud, I'm gonna need you to remember how ladders work. There you go, big guy. Don't do it. There's a robot right there. Don't. I fucking knew it. Let's go, kids. Thanks. I was a soldier. Well, you see, Cloud here used to be a soldier. He was. Did you go fight in the war? I might have. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> You're enjoying this, Cloud. You're enjoying this a little bit too much. All right, screw you, kids. Don't even wait for us. Goddamn. All right, how many more Pinkie Pies are they gonna send after us? Um. Piece of cake. Yeah. Here we go. Oh shit. No holding back. I got you, kids. These things are pushovers. You guys can kill these things with a stick. You get there, Trust me, you don't. Trust me, you don't want to be a soldier. Can I just met you? Look at you, Mr. Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Yeah. It was really cool when you went like. Yeah. Oh, the innocence of a child. If I give you a sword, will you shut up? <laughs> He's just so fucking done with these kids. Realistically speaking, <laughs> fuck them kids. Oh boy. Tifa, wait! Tifa! Tifa! Tifa? Tifa? Don't mind me, it's just emotional What's baggage. Wrong? Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like. I don't know how to explain. Someone special. I see. It's complicated. You don't understand. We have a troubling relationship. She was my childhood friend. What's up, kid? You gonna treat me with some goddamn respect? Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay. Did that I kid make it? And here, since you're so cool. Thanks. You guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. All right. Did some kid already make a model Buster Sword? Holy shit! <laughs> Look at you making a difference, Glad. The hell? Oh yeah, old geezer. Don't worry, it'll be okay. Wait. Don't touch it. Hey, old geezer. Not him. It looks pretty damn similar. Huh? Don't swear in front of the kids. Why too? Who knows? Come to think. The reunion. There's nothing to fear. <laughs> Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Yeah, accident. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. What? Then you must be 
The hell kind of response was that? Oh, right. Anyway, let's go. What the hell? Yeah, what's up? I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. Do you think you might be interested in helping out? Sure. Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. Uh, Moogle Kid behind me? Don't worry. I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. So... I... I need your story right away. Oh my! Is that a Moogle? You can see me, Koopa? Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case... Welcome to the Moogle Emporium! I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopa. I opened a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Hmm. Uh, are you talking about me? Can't be. Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopa. Anyway, we collected all kinds I'm gonna let that slide because you are a really sweet kid. Okay, so that's what I use these damn Moogle members for. Alright, well. Yeah, sure. <laughs> it's made out of cardboard and shit. <laughs> that's cute. Alright. How about now, kid? Am, 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 I, am I part of the cool kids club? If you find any Moogle medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. Alright. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course. Just like Mog the Moogle. You're a cute kid. You are a cute kid. Mr. Merc? Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. I still don't know how I feel about you. <laughs> I I need more time to feel you out. I don't know. Don't take that out of context. Graveyard key? A key to the gate at the Sector 5 slums graveyard? Kid, what the hell are you doing with this? I'll take it. The art of sword play. A primer on proper sword technique. Increases crowd skill points. I like that. Ooh, wait. That's a lot. Hold on. And there's that. Barret. Way of the Fist. Well, I use Cloud the most. So yeah, I'll I'll get it for Cloud. Alright, yeah, fuck yeah, I'll take it. Thanks to you, I've got a ton of medals to go, which means I can bring happiness to a ton of people. Good for you. Hey Cloud. Maybe say it like you mean it. Not until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile. From ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. This kid. Good luck, guys. <laughs> this kid is gonna grow up to be an excellent con man when he's older. What's up, lady? Oh. You're that former soldier, aren't you? Yes, ma'am. Cloud, was it? Yes, ma'am. Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah. I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Why you got these kids out patrols? here doing patrols? Is that a leaf house thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see, I have some important plans this evening. Ooh, really you got a date. Who's it with, Miss Folia? To go round them up? Oh, that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. Ooh, you got yourself a date, Miss Folia. Who you fucking? Hey there. How goes the patrol? Great. I've been picking up garbage and giving people directions. Plus, I helped an old lady cross the street. What street? <laughs> it's, been busy. it's a normal day for me. Gotta work hard. The house depends on people's donations. What street? Oh, no. I'm late. 
Did you see Miss Folia? Is she mad? Oh, I gotta go. I'm sorry. <laughs> what street? There's no fucking streets here. It's just a shithole. Hey, kid, what's up? As I should. Hey there. How goes the patrol? I've been watching them really close. I'm trying to learn all about the business. You want to open up a shop of your own someday? Yeah, so I can earn lots of money and use it to help the house. How sweet. The teachers don't like to talk about it, but we know the donations aren't enough to keep things running. Yeah. But that's a secret, okay? I'm not supposed to tell anyone. Anyway, I gotta go study. Yes, you do. If you know you gotta go study, then goddammit, what are you doing here? Wow, you're that soldier, right? Can I ask you a super important question? What's up? I heard bad people broke the Mako reactor, and there's gonna be another war because of it. Nah. Is that true? Maybe. No, but isn't there something else you should be worrying about right now? <gasps> I forgot about Miss Folia's lesson. I gotta head back to the house. Damn, girl, you didn't have to push me like that. Oh, can I go inside this person's house? This is not a house, this is a library question mark? What is this place? It's a bunch of people sitting down, but then there's also tables and, and there's music. I guess this is a library? <laughs> a romantic version of the victory theme, I like it. Did you make a great job. chocobo wonderful. painting out of flowers? Oh, I nearly forgot. I saw some Shinra suit walking towards your house a little while ago. Oh. He was dressed all in black. A little scary looking. We'll deal with that in a second. Uh, oh, you look like a damn ghostbuster. Sir, it's a real honor to meet you. I think At you your guys are awesome. I want to be strong and tough when I grow up too. You sound very determined. These are dangerous times. A reactor blew up and a bunch of kids lost their friends and families. Who knows what might blow up next? I guess that means more children might be coming to the house soon. And I think the teachers are going to have a whole lot more work to do. Speaking of teachers, Miss Foley is looking for you. Oh man, I completely forgot! I have to get back right now! <laughs> That's everyone. Let's go back to the house. Kid look like a damn Ghostbuster. You know what? At least these kids are showing me some damn respect right now. I won't take it from anybody else, but hey. The kids are the future, so they say. So I'll take whatever respect I can from them. Miss Folia, you can make it to your date now. <clears throat> the children there you go. <laughs> came back, thanks to you two. You've been a great help. Okay, everyone, come inside. It's time to hit the books. You guys, the Toad King's back. I saw him near the hideout. The what? We gotta do something about him. Nah, I got this. The Toad King? A weird, creepy monster we've seen near the hideout lately. He wears a crown and walks around like he owns the place. If he's not a king, he's gotta be monster royalty at least. I bet a soldier could beat him up easy. Yeah, why are a bunch of kids going to solve this problem? But here's the thing. I don't work for free. Or cheap. But we don't have any money. <laughs> the watch wouldn't ask for money. But if we ask any other grown-ups for help, they'll find out about the hideout, and that'll be it. Give me your bat. We really don't want to lose the hideout. Come on, help us. Oh, and we'll give you some cool treasure if you do. And if that's not enough, I'll pay the rest of your fee once I open my shop. Well, if you won't help, then we'll just have to kill it ourselves. Yeah, you're gonna get slaughtered if you go there. I'll do it for three gil. Huh? I'm offering a special discount right now on Toad King jobs. Looks like it's your lucky day. Awesome! Now that's my kind of bargain. I'm sorry we I'll have take to that give bat. you such a dangerous job, but there's really no one else we could have asked. Really like there are only hope. Yeah, I got this. The Hedgehog Pie King. Okay. Alright. I'm assuming you are the King Toad I've heard so much about. He really just stunned it on me like that. I don't accept that. The leader of a hedgehog pie pack. This self-styled king wears a toy crown it picked up in the slums. It attacks by charging into foes with the spines on its back and by casting spells. Inflicting a certain amount of damage. Blah, 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 blah. Cure. 
Don't hurt me. Son of a bitch, what did I say? Listen, Aerith, I don't want any of your shit right now, okay? And they keep fucking healing themselves, which I despise. Uh... Here you go, big man. Get up. Okay, up and at him. You're still doing okay, right? Uh, relatively, and they're all the way back up to full health. God fucking damn it. Oh, she is super fucking dead. God damn it. Oh, no. Try me. I don't like that bounce move y'all be doing. And you're gonna do it again, eh? Yeah, stop that shit. No, Cloud, really? <laughs> no, 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 I'm gonna need to ask you to stop that. Fucking just lay down. Fuck you. Aerith, I'm dealing with something right now. Uh, fuck it, fire. We'll deal with this Toad King in a second. Fuck off me. Oh my god, you're so annoying. Uh... You. I... Prayer. Okay. Appreciate you. Now, you need to go... Oh my god! As soon as I put out my block, then you just stop. Fucking just die! Calling fire. No, god damn it! Just fucking die. Holy shit. Oh my god. No, you just... Where did you get that fuck ton of health from? No, 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 no. Fuck this. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Where the fuck are you? You're dying. Oh my fucking god. Just die. You aren't shit compared to whatever the fuck your minions were. You weren't shit. And we're safe. Your fucking disciples should be more of a fit king than you were. Jesus fucking Christ, that was so annoying. He just kept healing and then he just got a burst of like 25% of his health just for no damn reason. Yeah, I killed it. Did you defeat the Toad King? Yeah. He wasn't shit. His disciples were the ones that were hard. Real good. Awesome! I knew you could do it! Now we don't have to worry about the king and his smelly friends! Thank you so much! Hey, I actually got his bat! This is for you, the treasure we promised. It's definitely... <laughs> I was just kidding, but I'm glad you gave me the bat. I'll okay, take it. Okay, kids. Playtime's over for now. I've prepared a special assignment for everyone. One that I expect you to finish today. Understood? Uh, yes! Yes, Miss Folia! You kids I have fun. I appreciate you getting rid of the Toad King, by the way. No problem. Wow, Miss Folia. You must know all their secrets. I mean, she works oh, with them. If only. Easier said than done. They're always on the move, looking for new adventures, chasing new dreams. All while trying to make the lives of everyone around them just a little bit better. I try to make sure they don't stumble and fall. And when they finally do, I help them back up. <laughs> Sounds exhausting. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> Sometimes it is. But I want the children to know that until they can stand on their own two feet, that I'm here to support them, care for them, love them. That even if we're not actually related, we're still a family. A real family, in all the ways that matter. If I can do that for them, then, well, then maybe I'm making this world a better place. I know you are. My predecessor taught me everything I know. I just took up his torch and ran with it, I guess. Uh, not that I'm anything close to what he was. Biggs is one of a kind. What? <gasps> oh no! I've completely lost track of time! Excuse me? You need to be? More like a dream I need to fulfill. Thank you again for your help. Y I wonder what kind of dream she's chasing tonight. Are we just not going to talk about that? Thanks again for saving our hideout from the king. No problem, Ness. In return, I let everyone know you guys can join the game as special guests. If you the want game. to know more, then come to the hideout. Okay. 
Thanks, Ness. Also, so we're just not going to talk about that? Is she talking about the same bigs? Alright, whatever. That was really fucking sweet, by the way, that little speech that she gave. Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. Oh. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need it'd be terrifying. Willing and able to fight. I'm down. I'll handle it. <laughs> you will? Oh man, you're the best. I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Yeah. Be careful. They look dangerous. Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about, man. Those things are freaky as shit. Is that a is is that is that a tricycle truck? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. So this is the graveyard the kid was talking about? Jesus. My god, alright, there's definitely gonna be some monsters popping out of the wall here. Or not? There's spores and there's spider webs everywhere. Let's What's go. up, bitches? Uh, weakness, wind. That's a damn shame I have that on one of the people I'm not with right now. Modified versions of the mono drive. Not only did these cre or creations survive the Mako Reactor 5 explosion, the Mako spill caused them to grow in both size and strength. Great. Don't beat yourself up, Cloud. These people are fucking hard as shit. God. Jesus Christ. Oh, bitch. God. Damn it. Cruelly reinforced baseball bat designed to beat the living tar out of anything and everything. I can't hold any materia in it, though, so it's kind of useless. For fuck's sake. I can't believe you. I don't want to hear any goddamn sass from you right now, Earth. Uh, fuck you. Get up, Clyde. I'm here. Oh god. Whoa! They burrow under the ground. They do so much fucking damage when they do that, Clyde. I'm gonna need you to back that ass up like Juvenile said. You ain't got no kind of health. Uh, here you go. Here you go, buddy. Take this. Stay strong, okay? Shit. It's your turn. Taking over. Oh, I can switch. Well, now I feel fucking stupid. Stay strong and carry on. Go all out. Oh, that really fucking helps. Uh. Oh, one of them died. All right, shit. I'll use it on you. Well, that did jack shit. <laughs> Nothing to it. <sighs> well, I don't know about that. Time to burn. I think that's the first time I've ever seen you fuckers get pressured. And you're right back up, of course. Enough. Jesus Christ. 